not sure this one's like it's uh, been up to Portland Lake in the past. That's just around the corner, so I thought I'd come and check out this today. My plan was to get the drone up, but it's a bit breezy, so I'm not sure that's going to happen. few cows here. I think I'm going to walk on the other side of the fence. Yeah, so I think I made the right decision in coming back on this side of the fence because uh, a lot of these cows uh, seem very curious about when I moved across and I've read online that when people will be coming here that uh, some of them is charged so I'm just going to play it safe and walk on this side of the wall. I'm sure it'll be fine but you can see they're clearly out of me. And on the other side of this wall is an electric fence so if I did have to jump it I'd probably get electrocuted at the same time. So this guy he doesn't seem trail here
I've not been here before. But I can imagine this being pretty cool. Let's play in the comments. That was windy. It's January, it's not that cold, it's windy, it's got, there's a bit of chill but it's, at least I'm getting out of the house, you know what I mean? Uh, it's So I've recently been getting this camera, this is the DJI Action 4 and I'm pretty impressed so far, it seems rugged enough and quality seems good enough, I'm still kind of learning more features, um, but yeah I had just a mobile phone for that I was using on a gimbal and I can put enough space and things so I thought I'd just find the bullet and get the Action camera.
last year uh, in the summer I'd done the Coast and Castle cycle, which was, uh, I think it was uh, three or four days, uh, cycled from Newcastle to, to Edinburgh. Um, stopping off, I think we stopped at Amble, Berwick, Melrose, and then Edinburgh on the last day. That was good, we raised a bit of money for Mind, the charity that helps with mental health. Um, and yeah, so uh, hopefully I'll get a decent other charity thing this year. And it was a shame because I didn't have any recording equipment last year, so I didn't um, didn't make any videos or anything, but this year I'll definitely, definitely do it. Now I'm coming to the end of the trail and I think I need to take a left here, but the, the, the road actually goes down. So I am just going to check my map on the, the apps and I'll, I'll see where I need to go. Yeah, apparently I just keep following this track down uh, and then it cuts back to the left. So we'll, we'll see. Uh, it would be great if you could um, just leave us some comments on that I'm making, if you like them, uh, if you like the drawn ones, if you like the hiking ones, if you want to see more wild swimming, camping, just outdoor stuff in general, it would be great. It would be uh, really helpful just to sort of improve the channel a bit more, tailor to the watching. I'm glad I've done the loop because the, the way the, the app, the commute, or however you pronounce it, told me to go was just uh, there and back, like a hairpin. Whereas I've kind of looped around using this little board and footpath to make it more of a circular route, which I'm sure is a common way that more people would do, but just uh, always an advertised on the, on the app. So, yeah. So that's me back in the car. Um, my 
my watch says that I'd done about 2.3 miles, so and I didn't really start until 10 minutes in, so I guess that's about two and a half miles, maybe a little bit more. So it wasn't a big hike, but it was good just to get out of the house. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time.